Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Now we start to do this new work. Here I have chain 12. We use first stitch. We make a circle, then we do chain 3, use for the first double crochet. In this circle, we do 30 double crochet. Okay, double crochet yarn over, pull back yarn. One, two, finish one double crochet. Finish 30 double crochet, we'll come back. Now we finish the 30 double crochet. When we come to the first double crochet, we do chain three from bottom, we check one, two, three, the third stitch, slip stitch. Then we start to do round two, we do chain three, use for the first double crochet. In this same stage, we make a five double crochet. Okay, same stage we have one, two, three, four, five. Finish this chain five. And we skip yarn over and we do double crochet. We skip one, two, three, four. Number five stage, we make a five double crochet. Okay, finish five double crochet chain five. And you repeat this. We should have six this part and six chain five space, six this five double crochet shell. Now we are at the end of round two. We finish this six part one, two, three, four, five, six. We need to do last chain five. The last chain five we do a different way. We do chain three. We need a Chain two, then we yarn over. We use this first double crochet top stage. We make half double crochet. Yarn over, pull through these three loops. Half double crochet we use for chain two. So here we have chain three. Last chain five we do this way because round three we will start here. So we do chain three use for the first double crochet. We use this space. We do five double crochet power column. Okay, now we have check, we have. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so first at this stage, we do slip stage. Make one power count. Okay, no chain. We come here and this five double crochet, the second one, the fourth one, we make two. So the first double crochet stage, we still do one double crochet. The second stage, we make two double crochet. One, this stage, we do one more. And the third one, we make one. The fourth one, we make two. One, two. And the last one we make one. So here five becomes seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, the second one we make two. Number four we make two. Now we finish the seven double crochet. Then we use this five double crochet, the second stage. First one, two close to double crochet, we don't use the second stage. 
we use to make five double crochet power count you know how to do a uh, finish this finish here chain three then we use this chain five this side the second stage the first one if you use then you cannot do this double crochet so we use the second stage to do power count Okay, we have five double crochet. We finish this power count. Okay, done. We use we do same way. The first double crochet we make one double crochet. Okay, the second one we make two. We just repeat here. Five become seven. Now we add the end of round three. Now finish this last pop count. We do chain three. And first the pop count. This stitch we make slip stitch. Finish this round. You see the first pop count. We didn't use a stitch. This one. It look different. So use stitch. We lock the bottom look better. And we start to do round four. We need to use this space between first double crochet and the and this pop count. This space we make we do pop count so slip stage. We move in this space, then we do chain three use for the first double crochet. This space we do pop count. In this work, pop count is the same thing. I always use five double crochet to make pop count. So you know this. Okay, we finished this first pop count. This seven double crochet, we skip first one, skip last one. So the second double crochet stage, we make double crochet. So here we have only five double crochet. We skip last one. We have five double crochet. We skip first one. And okay. this side we do same thing we use this space between this double crochet and the pop count this space we make a, another pop count Okay, we finish this pop count, we do 25 in this round. Then we skip here, we use this side. First double crochet and a pop count, this space. We do pop count.
Okay, here is the beginning we repeat here. From here to this chain 5 is one part and we finish. Can you repeat this? Now we finish the round 4, finish the last chain 5, then first the popcorn stage. We make a slip stage. Okay, and we start to do round 5. It's the same way we use this space between this double crochet and the popcorn. Do slip stage move in. In this space, we make five double crochet power count. Okay. Finish the power count. So this five double crochet, we skip first one, skip last one. Skip this, skip this, we have three. Finish. Okay, skip last one. And this space between popcorn and this last, last double question, sorry. Space we make. Finish here, we do chain 3, and this chain 5 space will make one double crochet, chain 3. One part we finish, and you repeat at the beginning. This space between first double crochet and power count here, you do power count, repeat here. Now we finish it around the five. Uh, finish the last chain three, power count stitch, slip stitch. We start to do around the six. It's same way. This space we make one power count, so slip stitch move in. Chain three, use for the first double crochet. We finish this power count. Okay, we finish this prop count then. This three skip first one, skip last one. We have only one double crochet. Finish. Then this side space we make one prop count. Okay, finish. Here we do chain four. And this double crochet stitch, we do one double crochet chain one, one double crochet chain one. We need a three double crochet. Okay, finish here, chain four. And you repeat the beginning. We finish the one part now. And you repeat here. We do popcorn. Repeat. Okay. Finish it around the six. If yours a little bit tight, if too tight, then here you can do chain five, chain five. Last round you can do chain four, chain four. Okay. A little bit tight is okay. Next round will be better. Now we finish this chain four. Same thing. Our corn stage. We do slip stage. Then we use this double crochet. We start with round seven. Uh, this only one stitch here. We make slip stitch, move in. Then we use this stitch to do power count. One double crochet here. Finish this prop count, chain seven. One, two, three, four. 
5, 6, 7, 8. Then we use this double crochet. Stitch. Each one we make one double crochet. So we do double crochet. Chain 3. Next to the stitch, we make one double crochet. Then we do chain three. We have three double crochet here. Okay. Chain three, chain three. Finish this chain seven. And you repeat. We have only one double crochet here. You do part count. Now we are at the end of round 7. We need to do chain 7 then do slip stitch. This last chain 7 we do different way. We do chain 5. Then we make half double crochet yarn over. Pop count stitch. Here we make half double crochet. We use for chain 2. Then here we have chain 5. Last chain 7 we do this way. Then we do chain 8. Chain, we do chain 1 for the basic stitch. In this space here we make single crochet then we do chain seven one two th so three four five six seven chain seven space we make single crochet then we do chain seven we finish a single crochet always do chain seven this round one two th three four five six seven we make another single crochet in this chain 7 space. Then we do chain 7. Chain 7 space, we make two single crochet. Okay. You also can use the stage, second one, and the last second, or you can use the space to do single crochet. Then chain 3 space, we make one single crochet, each one. Finish this single crochet, we still do chain 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Next, chain 3 space, we do single crochet. Then we do chain 7. Next, chain 7 space, we make first single crochet, chain 7. Then the second single crochet in the same space, chain 7. Okay, we skip part count, we only use this chain 7 space, so here. Okay, and now, here it from the beginning, and here, okay, from the beginning to here, it's one part of before pop count this chain seven space the second single crochet we finished is one part of. okay so it's one part of how many chain seven space we should have one two three four five six one part of we should have six chain seven space okay and we have six patterns so we should have 36 chain 7 space finish this round. Now we're at the end of round 8. Huh? This last chain 7 space, at the beginning we have one single crochet. So we finish this single crochet. So here we have two single crochet. Then we do chain 7. The last chain 7 we do different. We, we do chain 3. Then we yarn over twice. We make a triple crochet. We use this single crochet stage. We make one, two, three. Finish the one triple crochet we use for chain four. Here we have chain three. So last chain seven we do this way because round nine we need to start from here. So this chain seven space we do chain one. In this space we make one single crochet. The next chain seven space we do nine double crochet. So we do four, one, Two, three, 
two. We have four double crochet. Number five should be the middle one. We do one double crochet. Then we do chain fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, then we use this double crochet. Two loops here. We make one slip stitch. To do this ash. Okay. Then next, then we use this space to do next four double crochet. One, two, three, four. Okay, we have this. So each side we have one, two, three, four. The number five, this double crochet, we do this. And here we have one, two, three, four. Total we have nine double crochet. Finish this one. And next, chain seven space. We do single crochet. The next one, you repeat this beginning. So make sure in round eight, you should have this chain seven space. You should have 36. Uh, so here we have 18, this part of this shell. Okay. Now we finish it around the nine. Uh, Finish the last of this shell, we should do single crochet, but here at the beginning, we already finished this. We do triple crochet here, okay, this stage, we make slip stage. Okay. We start to do round 10. In round 10, we need to start from here. This number 8, this stage. You can cut your yarn, come here. If you don't want to cut the yarn, we do slip stitch. So here we have five double crochet. Each one we make one slip stitch. Okay, then we need to use number eight stitch. So we have eight slip stitch. Finish one by one. So this number eight, this is stage, we start here. In this stage, we do seven double crochet. One, two, three, use for the first double crochet. In this same stage, we use stage to do double crochet. So here we use this number eight stage. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So here this slip stage we have eight plus five. We have thirteen. Finish this chain seven. This chain seven. We come to next so this chain. 15 space. If you want to use this uh, space, it's okay, maybe easier, but it look a little bit different. You can try to use space. 
The bottom look white if we use space. Okay, but I think use stage look better. If too difficult, then you use space. So we count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This one should be number eight. This stage we do. We use this stage. Take some time to do this. So if you like your space, it's okay. okay. We use this stage to do double crochet. Yeah. So, yeah, no more. We make seven double crochet in this same stage. Better we use two loops to do this. Okay, we finish one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, then we do chain seven, you repeat. We have 18 on uh, this shell. So we should have 18, this seven double crochet shell. And at the end of round 10, we finish this last double crochet. We need to do chain seven. The last chain seven, we do different way. We do chain five. We need a chain two, then we use this first double crochet here, stage. First double crochet, we do chain three from bottom one, two, three, the third one. We do half double crochet. Yarn over, pull through three loops. Okay. This half double crochet we use for chain two. Here we have chain five. Last chain seven, we do this way because Round 11, we will start from here. So this stage here, we do power count. We do chain three, use for the first double crochet. And here, you can use stage or you just use this space to do five double crochet. Okay, Okay, so here we have five double crochet. The first stitch here. We do slip stitch. Okay, we finish this first five double crochet. Uh, and here seven, the number three, number five, we make a two, so seven become nine. The first double crochet stage, we make one double crochet. Mm. Little bit tight here. Sorry. The second, the third one, we make two. Uh. One more. Number four. Number five. We make two. One more, this stage. And number six. Number seven. So we finish here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine double crochet. Finish it here. Chain seven. We use the second stitch to do popcorn.
So make sure which one is popcorn. This is double crochet. Don't use this. High five. We use this stitch uh, to do popcorn. Okay, finish this popcorn, chain three. And here we use the second stitch. Don't use the first one, then you will hide this double crochet. We use the second stitch to do popcorn. Okay, and we repeat the beginning now. Finish this, you make this seven become nine. Okay, the first one we make one, the second one we make one, the third stage we make two, one more, number four. Number five, we make two, one more, this number five stage. And number six, number seven. Okay, we have nine double crochet, and you repeat this part. Now we finish it around 11. Finish the last part count, chain three, we come to the First, the part count stitch, slip stitch, finish this round. We start to do round 12. We need to use this space between double crochet and part count. This space, so slip stitch, move in. In this space, we do part count, chain three. Use for the first double crochet. Now we have five double crochet. Okay, we finish this popcorn. And we do. So here, nine double crochet, skip first one, skip last one, we have seven. Uh, we use the second double crochet. First one we skip, this is the second one. Do double crochet, one. Okay, here, so we skip this last the double crochet, skip the first one. So here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven double crochet. Finish here. This space between pop count and the double crochet. This space will make another pop count. Okay, here. We finish. Then we do chain five. One, two, three, four, five. You repeat the next pattern. Between this, we make half count. Then nine double crochet becomes seven. The pattern is very easy. Now we finish the round twelve. Finish the last chain five, come to the first part, come slip stitch. Now we start to do round 13. Same way we use this space between double crochet and the power count. We make slip stitch, then we do power count. Now finish this. Okay, we finish the pop count, then skip the first double crochet, skip the last one, so we have five double crochet left.
Okay, we have five double crochets. Keep the last one. Finish this popcorn. Okay, so here we have five double crochet. Finish this, we do chain three. Chain five space, we make one double crochet, then we do chain three. And one pattern we finish. We repeat this. Okay. Now we finish the round 13. I already finished the slip stitch. We start to do round 14. So here, same as the last round. Slip stitch, then you do popcorn. Okay, use this space. Okay, finish this pop counts. Keep the first ones, keep last them. We have one, two, three. Finish. Okay, then this side, pop count. Here we have three double crochet. Finish here, we still do chain three in this round. And this double crochet stage, we do one double crochet chain one. Finish here, chain three. Then you repeat the pattern. Here you make Okay. Now we finish it around fourteen. Okay, finish this last chain three power con slip stitch. We do round fifteen. We use this the first the double crochet and the second double the third first and the third double crochet post to do front post double crochet power count so we do slip stitch move in this first double crochet post then we do chain one we use this first double crochet post to, to do single crochet chain two front post single crochet chain two then we use this post we do same thing and uh, we make five grand post double crochet. Okay, now we have five, one, two, three, four, five. The first one we do slip stitch. Finish this popcorn, we do chain three. And this, this second, we skip the third one, we use post to do the same thing. Okay, finish this two popcorn. Now we do chain three. Here we have three double crochet. Each stage we make one double crochet. Finish this chain two. The second one we make one double crochet chain two. Finish the last double crochet we do chain three. Then we finish the one part and you repeat this. Post this one, this one to do one post. Double crochet popcorn. Now we finish the round 15. Finish the last chain 3. And this popcorn stage we do slip stage. And we start to do round 16. We need to use this popcorn post to do another popcorn chain 1. Use this post to do front post single crochet first. Then we do chain 2. Use for the first front post double crochet. We use this post to do another four double crochet. Okay, 
Okay, we have five double crochet now. And we use this first stitch, finish this half count. We do front post half count. We do front post double crochet half count. Finish here, we still do chain three. Then this post, same thing, we finish. Finish this two pop count. Here in this round we do chain four. Last round we do chain three. Here we do chain four. And this double crochet stage we still to make one double crochet. Chain three. Second double crochet stage we make one double crochet. Chain three. Make one double crochet chain. Four. So here we do chain four, chain four, chain three, chain three. Okay, then you repeat, use post to do this. We finish the round 16. I already started round 17 here, same as last round. Okay, finish with this two pop count here. Then we do chain five. Here we have four, one, two, three, four chain space. Each one we make one single crochet. Then we do chain seven. Next one, single crochet. Chain seven. Each chain space will make one single crochet. Finish the last single crochet, chain five. Then you repeat this. You do pop count here. Okay, here, same as here, make pop count. Now we finish the one part. So here we have chain five, chain five, chain seven, three chain seven. Before and after pop count, we do chain five. Now we finish the round 17. I already started round 18 here, same as the last round. Okay. Finish this power count, chain 5. We skip this chain 5 space. We use chain 7 space to do single crochet. And this next, the chain 7 space, we make 5 double crochet. One, two, three, four, five. Finish this chain three. Then we make another five double crochet. Okay, finish here. This chain seven space, single crochet. So keep this chain five space. Same as here, we do chain five. Finish the one part, then you do pop count here. Okay, one part we finish, you repeat. Now we finish the round 18. I already started round 19 here, same as last round. Finish this two pop count, we do chain nine. Then we come here, this chain three space, we do one single crochet. 
and we make another chain four. We use this first chain here. We do one slip stitch. Then in this chain three space, we make another single crochet. Then we do chain nine. And you do this pop cone, same as here, you repeat this. Okay. Now we finish the round 19. I finish the slip stitch, then we start to do round 20, should be the last round. We need to use chain 3 space, so slip stitch move in. In this space, we do one single crochet, then we do chain 3. We use this single crochet two loops to do slip stitch. Then this space we make another single crochet. We finish here. This chain nine space we do eight single crochet. Okay, then here, this post, use this post to do back post, the single crochet here. From back, we make one single crochet. Okay, then we come to next, the chain nice space, we make a single crochet. Eight a single crochet. Uh, come to this repeat at the beginning in this channel three space we make one single crochet chain three and we use single crochet these two loops to do slip stage then we do one single crochet you repeat Thanks for watching. Hope to see you next time. Bye bye.